It's perfectly normal to feel angry when you have been mistreated or wronged. Anger becomes problem when you express it in a very unhealthy or wrong way harming you or others. Some immature people think that venting their anger is healthy, that the people around them are too sensitive to handle it, their anger is justified or they need to show their fury to get respect. How naive and immature. The truth is, anger is much more likely to have a negative impact on the way people see you. It may impair your, your judgment and get in the way of your success. The true goal of anger management isn't to suppress feelings of anger, but to understand the message behind the emotion and express it in a healthy way without losing control. When you do it rightly, you will feel better, you will achieve your target, you will be in a better position to manage conflicts in your life and you will strengthen your relationships. Mastering the art of anger management takes work. But the more you practice, the easier it will get. And the payoff is huge. Learning to control your anger and expressing it in a right way will help you build better relationships, achieve your goals and lead a healthier, more satisfying life. So, are you ready to know the tips of anger management? Let's start. Tip number one. Explore what's really behind your anger because anger is not a primary emotion, it's a secondary emotion. So focus, is your anger masking other feelings such as fear, embarrassment, insecurity, hurt, shame or vulnerability? Anger can be a symptom of another underlying health problem such as depression, especially in men trauma or chronic stress these all emotions will manifest as anger tip number two identify your triggers like toxic person or toxic environment traffic jams avoid them as much as possible do you think too much negative to beat negative thinking you need to control your negative thoughts and bring your mind in the present. That's called being mindful. Practice it. Mind is like kid. It will go into the past or future. Be firm. Grab your thoughts. Bring it to the present. Keep practicing. Focus on your blessings. Now, once you are in present, follow tip number three. Tip number three, be aware of your anger warning signs like knots in your stomach, clenching your hands or jaw, feeling calmy or flushed, breathing faster, headaches, pacing or needing to walk around, seeing red, having trouble concentrating, pounding heart, tensing your shoulders. Tip number four, Learn ways to cool down quickly, like take deep breaths, get moving like brisk walking will do. Use your senses. You can use smell, hearing, touch, taste and sight to quickly relieve stress and cool down. For example, try listening to your, your favorite piece of music. Eat your favorite dish, drink a cup of tea or stroke a bit. Stretch or massage areas of stress like shoulders, your neck and scalp. Slowly count to 10. Tip number 5. Find healthier way to express your anger. In my first video, I talked about justifiable anger which helps us bring positive changes in society and relationship. To learn more on how to resolve conflict in a positive way, Never focus on winning the argument. Remember, 
if you win the argument you will lose the person forever respect others and their viewpoint don't get it, don't get into the habit of digging the past skeleton focus on the present issue always be willing to forgive if your anger starts to spiral out of control remove yourself from the situation for a few minutes or for as long as it takes you to cool down no when to let go of something or quit a game this is very important quitting the game tip number 6 stay calm by taking care of yourself taking care of your overall mental and physical well-being can help ease tension and diffuse anger problems manage stress by trying practicing relaxation techniques such as mindfulness meditation progressive muscle relaxation or deep breathing talk to someone you trust giving vent to your emotions by talking to someone who is a good listener will help a lot get enough sleep lack of sleep can exacerbate negative thoughts and leave you feeling agitated and short tempered try to get 7 to 9 hours of good quality sleep exercise regularly it's an effective way to burn off tension and ease stress and it can leave you feeling more relaxed and positive throughout the day aim for at least 30 minutes on most days be smart about alcohol and drugs they lower your inhibitions and can make it even harder to control your anger even consuming too much of caffeine like tea coffee can make you more irritable and prone to anger tip number 7 use humor to relieve tension try using directed humor rather than anger to defend yourself it helps forge strong meaningful healthy connection and intimacy with others in many situations rather than escalating the situations but kindly avoid sarcasm tip number 8 recognize if you need professional help if despite putting these all anger management techniques into practice your anger is still spiraling out of control or if you are getting into trouble with the law or hurting others you need professional help medical help thank you